Hi, this is Mike from the Excel Trainer. While searching the online templates from Microsoft, I came across a great any year calendar. However, when I started to use it, I came across a problem due to the way that my computer's configured. I also found a solution to the problem. Let me show you. The calendar template that I'm going to use is actually this one. It's already on my computer because I've used it. But if you don't have it, then you can download it just by clicking into the search box and searching for calendar any year. Pressing enter. It actually comes up with quite a lot of calendars and this is the one that we're going to use. So I click on create and it creates me a new calendar based on that template. It actually starts on 2012, but by using the scroll bar here, I can choose any year I want. And you can see as I do go through the years, it shows me the correct dates against the correct days. Each cell contains a formula and the formula either puts a number into the cell or leaves the cell blank. So, for example, in 2013, January the 1st was a Tuesday. So the Sunday and the Monday of that week are left blank because they were actually part of December 2012. The Friday and the Saturday of the week beginning January the 27th are actually in February. So those cells are left blank in January's block. Let's have a look at the formula. I'll just pick a date at random. In this cell, the formula says... If the year of Jan Sun 1 plus 17 equals the year, and the month of Jan Sun 1 plus 17 equals 1, then what goes in this cell is Jan Sun 1 plus 17. Otherwise, this cell is left blank. So, what is the year? Well, the year is actually the name that's been assigned to cell B2 up here. If I click on the name drop down and select the year, it takes me to that cell. So that's the cell that contains the year. But what about Jan Sun 1, Feb Sun 1, etc.? Those aren't listed in the name box. If I go to the formulas tab and go to the name manager, you can see they're actually listed there. What they are are named formulas. If I make that wider, you can see the actual formulas themselves. Each named formula performs a date calculation. The formulas, as you can see, use the date value function. Now, I'm not going to go into any detail, but each formula references the first day of the specific month. If I select a formula for April, it's using the 1st of April of the current year for the calculation. And the order of the arguments in the function is month, day, year. So what's the problem you're thinking? Well, if you're based in the USA or any other country where the date format is month, day, year, then everything works okay. The problem comes when your computer is set to UK format, as mine is. Let me show you. Go into the control panel go to region and language and set it back to United Kingdom. I'll only set it to United States for this demo. You can see the date formats are all variations, uh, apart from the bottom one, but they're all variations of day, month, year. So let's stick with the default. Click OK and close the control panel. And you can see now most of the dates have disappeared. The formulas in the cells are still there. The problem is all down to the named formulas. So let's go back to the name manager. Because my computer is set to UK and the date format is day, month, year, the date referenced in the formulas is not correct. For example, in April, it thinks it should be referencing the 4th of January 2013, not the 1st of April. Now, you'll have to update each one of these formulas. I'm not going to go through them all. I'm just going to change April so you can see how it works. So with April selected, I need to come down here, select 4 slash 1 and change it to 1 slash 4. 
do the same thing over here. Select 4 slash 1, change it to 1 slash 4. Click on the tick to complete that. Close. And you can see now that Aprils has updated. Aprils is now correct. Now, of course, if you work in a multi-regional company like I do, you will need two copies of the template configured differently for those regions that use day, month, year and those that use month, day, year.